Are you excited? I don't know, should I be? Yes, you're about to go on a wonderful trip to freaking Tasty Town. Tasty Town? Tasty Town, not, my friend. Not Flavorville, but no, Tasty Town. Flavorville is in the rear view mirror. We're <laughs> moving on to Tasty Town. All right, let's try that. Oh boy. <laughs> A few episodes ago, I said that we needed to do a video where Cam brought his delicious combinations to the show. You've had like, I think one. One? Yes, because I mixed up the other one that you might have had. Okay. No, you did have the other one, but so, I mixed it up. So, a little bit of backstory in case you didn't see that episode. Cam, throughout our friendship, I have known him to have these weird combinations. <laughs> And I will never forget the very first weird combination I had was at his mother's and mother and father's house. And yes, you brought dear out- Dear mother and father. <laughs> <laughs> Currently, I, it was my house him? at the time. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, your Mama parents' and house. Mama and Papa's. Mama went, and Papa's house. I went to Mama and Papa Birch's house and Cam brought out popcorn and chunks yes. of cheese, cubes of cheese. That's right. And I was like, this guy doing you're like you just get the powdered cheddar and throw that on the popcorn see it's funny you mention wow one on the list. all right That's so right. this was the first concoction that i had of cams and i gotta say it sounds weird but it's actually really tasty. fantastic First stop on our tasty tour is the Cheesy Pop. Cheesy Pop. Cheesy Pop. Now, this is very important, okay? This ain't just any popcorn. Can't be using none of that microwave crap. Get that out of here. You need to get yourself an oil popper, okay? That's first step. Olive oil, extra virgin. Okay. Okay? None of that dirty, getting around, naughty vegetable oil. That crap shouldn't even be on the shelves. <laughs> Don't forget, none of that yellow popcorn. Nobody wants that. Pop's weird. Not all the kernels pop. Mm-mm. You gotta get yourself the white popcorn. I forgot the brand, but there's only one bag. Well, you need to tell them. You go to Walmart, you find the one that says white popcorn. It's in a baggie, not a little bottle. It's the only one that's white. And okay. it says white popcorn on it. Okay. I think Jolly Time, maybe? That might be it. We'll throw it up on the screen right now so that you know. And get yourself some extra sharp cheddar. All right. Okay. Now, remember... There's also a key in how you eat it. You got to get yourself a nice little, little handful. This isn't the cleanest of eats. Okay. I usually have a ton of popcorn all over myself when I'm done. <laughs> get yourself a piece of cheese and you got to go just shove it in. Okay. Mm. Mm. I got to say, so oh, good. It's even better than I remember. Mm hmm. That it's, is. Why is it so good? I don't know. It has to be the salty combination. Oh, I was gonna say, don't forget, you have to put an exorbitant amount of salt. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Miss that step. Yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. Wow. Mm. Oh, that's good. And you just take little nibbles of the cheese. Okay, it's perfect ratio. Oh. Bunch of popcorn, nibbles of cheese. That's fine. That I, I inhaled my, my cheddar. You just find what's right for you. Oh, that's so good. This one was called Cheesy Pop. Uh huh. I like the Cheesy Pop. Mmm. Classic. Now let's not fill ourselves up there. Okay. 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 Popcorn takes up a lot of room, you know, it's light and airy. Next up, appetizer, as it is, oh. is a little remix on something you have had. I call these the PVCs, multiple C's, peanut butter cheese crackers. Okay. So you've had my peanut butter cheese toast. Okay. PVC tea. <laughs> okay. But this is the PVCs. I like it. Okay. Okay. Got some creamy. Oh yeah, have to use creamy, not that crunchy. I like crunchy from here and there. Not good with this, gets a little too hard to chew. Okay, to me, crackers are extremely dry. Crackers Peanut are dry. Peanut butter is dry. It is. So it just gets like hard to swallow. It can. You gotta be careful, have a nice drink. That's another reason I love the popcorn, because I always have a massive drink of cold water, because it makes you real thirsty, and there's nothing more satisfying than quenching that thirst. He's very passionate. I am so passionate. Look at how clean that is. That's yeah. brand new. Yes, <laughs> okay, another key factor here. The cheese in both of these needs to be cold. Okay. Nobody wants lukewarm cheese, ruins it. Nobody wants sweaty cheese. No one likes sweaty cheese. No. So, okay. This one's so simple. Oh, that's a reject. Get out of here. Well, don't put it back in there. Just toss it to the side. Forward. If it's a reject, you throw it to the side. A little bit of peanut butter. The difference between this and the other one is, yeah, you only need a little bit. You just, like, that's it. 
Okay. That's, all the, that's all the PB you that's need. That's less peanut butter than those Austin crackers. It's true. All right. There we go. Okay, get your cheesies. All right. Nice little squares this time. Just get it right on there. Oh, yeah. See how simple, quick and easy. <laughs> Set it and forget it. There's Are you little, for real? There's a little PBC. PBC. That's your PBC. You gotta yeah. have saltine crackers, creamy peanut butter, extra sharp cheddar. Okay. Mm, get you. in there. Bink. Mmm. Wow. Yeah, take a minute. You gotta <laughs> let the saliva come back. <laughs> Another thing that I eat with a large glass of water. Can we get a large glass of water, please? Mmm. <laughs> this is so Gosh, good. Gosh, it's instant desert in my mouth. Just like dry. <laughs> <laughs> but it's so good! Oh man, my tongue's working overtime we're moving this around. Maybe that's why I have such a strong, sharp tongue. I gotta say, <laughs> the combo in my mind is still weird. Oh, man, is it dry. Oh, I'm taking a drink. Yeah, <laughs> that was a lot to work around. But see, the water afterwards is so satisfying. See, now I almost envision milk being better than water with this. I don't know. I've never tried. Milk and like peanut butter and jelly with milk. Oh, so good. Could be. Now, to me, this is no better than just peanut butter and crackers. No, it is better because there's cheese in the middle of it. I know, but the cheese, I don't, I hardly taste the cheese. The peanut oh, butter. Oh, well, you mean you hardly taste the cheese. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> the peanut fantastic. butter is so overpowering. Get a bigger piece of cheese. That's a pretty hefty piece of cheese. You can make it thicker. You decide. Okay. You decide your ratio. That's the beauty here, people. You decide your ratio. I mean, I'd rather just have cheese. But you got the salty and the crunch of the cracker. You got that rich, just sharp, cheddary kick. See, and I don't get that sharp, cheddary Brought kick. together, you gotta eat it more. I don't taste it. <sighs> I'm sorry, I'm man. Sad. People, you need to give these things a try and let us know what you think. I wanna know This, I mean, what you think. Let me know down in the comments if I'm crazy, but it's try it so yourself cool. and let me know if you can taste the cheddar. Cause to me, if oh, I can I taste, taste cheddar, cheddar, it is like very light. Who wants a cracker with just peanut butter and then you're just acid. See, the cheese gives you a little bit of moisture. <laughs> Otherwise, you're not breathing. <laughs> I could eat crackers, peanut butter, and then have a glass of milk, and that would be so good. See, it's not bad. I mean, I'm not. You're not wrong. You're just supplementing the dairy. I just gotta have that cheese. Well, maybe, maybe. Okay. Next stop on the train to Tasty Town. We're gonna call this the. Uh, I don't know what to call it. I want to say something with choo choo in it. Get it's it? It's a choo choo train. <laughs> the ch C H E W. Uh huh. Choo choo. <laughs> We're on the choo-choo train to Tasty Town. Yeah. I like that. I like it. The choo-choo train to now next, Tasty Town. Now next, we've had our appetizers. Okay. The thing with the popcorn is the salad. Cheese crackers is the appetizer. Wait, what? Yeah, just just do it. Just let it sink The in. popcorn is the now, salad? Now is the main course. Okay. This is called the CDB Bowl. Cheddar. CDB Bowl. CDB Bowl. Mm-hmm. Hmm. I don't know what that would be. Cheddar? Those are my initials. Oh. David Birch. The Cameron David Birch Bowl. And I named okay. it that because it was stolen right from under me and sold by a dirty chain. Who? KFC. <laughs> Those buttholes <laughs> stole what I had been doing since I was a wee child. Really? Yes. Oh, okay. Infuriating. This is what NSA is listening out for. New recipes mm -hmm. for, to sell the food chains. They got me. Let's get on this choo-choo train. Now we're in the fancy main cabin of the uh, oh choo-choo train. Oh boy. What is going on oh, here? Oh, Flavor City. We're in Flavor City. It's on the way to Tasty Town. Okay. First stop. Wow. Get your big old bow. <laughs> All right. Okay, you ready? This you got looks your, amazing. You got your taters. You got your corn. You got some brown gravy, some chicken. And cheese. Some cheese. You gotta have cheese. <laughs> <laughs> There's only one of these items tonight that doesn't have cheese in it, but it has a different kind of dairy. <laughs> so I'm just saying we maybe we should just add dairy and, and like cheddar to it. Just put cheese in everything. Yeah. Are you ready for this? I, I mean, I'm waiting. Eagerly. Oh my gosh. Okay. The thing you need to know about Cam in this dish that I'm already picking up on. Cam's favorite dish all time is Thanksgiving dinner. It is! I know! And I eat it the exact same way we're about to show you. <laughs> This is my supplemental meal okay, when walk, it's not Thanksgiving. <laughs> okay, walk me through this. What do we got here? Okay, you take up a giant dollop of that beautiful looking mashed potatoes. Okay. Well done. Those look fantastic. Oh, dropping some. Okay, giant dollop. Is that giant enough? No. <laughs> Better. 
Well, I'm not gonna eat all of this, am I? That's good, that's good. Oh, okay. That's okay. good. You can... I mean, these giant bowls do not help. They are massive. <laughs> these are like... I think and I'm these... not mad about it. <laughs> and then, you gotta do this, okay? Don't... This is oh. an important step. You gotta give it the little... Little hole. Oh, you gotta yeah, make yeah, it a, yeah. You gotta get a little area in there. Okay. For the rest of the ingredients. Okay. Okay, now take a spoonful of corn. Okay. Drop right in the center. I like corn. Lot. I'm gonna have to. He puts more in there. Corn there is you. so good. I love corn. I freaking love corn. Okay, now you get yourself a chick patty. Okay. Now you gotta cut it into little chunks. Oh, okay. So there's a little space over there. You can just use your good old you know, little fork here. You know? Now, where, where are these chicken patties from? The freezer? Well, I mean, like, you gotta give us brands, man. We gotta tell them how to make it down below See, so they can I try mean, it. You, the, that's the beauty of this here meal is it's not brand specific. But what brand is this one? I don't know, because I didn't buy them. They're going to want to try this exact same dish. I always get the Walmart like chicken patties that come in like a blue and red bag. Okay, no, it's not brand specific. It's just, it's just got to be breaded chicken patty circle things. These ones happen to be Banquet. They are Banquet brand, which is a fantastic brand. Just drop that in there, <laughs> spread her around. You know, you don't want it all in one spot. You want to evenly distribute the tastes throughout oh, the meal. I don't want my Too much in one spot. No, spread it around. Okay, okay. Spread it around. You're trying to go for even assortment in every bite. Okay. I think I've got okay. that now. Okay. Show them what, show them what you've done. All show right. Show what you've done. It's all over the place. It was oh, all nice yeah. and conform earlier. Yes, yeah. mm -hmm. Okay, now, get yourself some of that deliciously brown gravy. Deliciously brown. Deliciously brown. Nice and dark. It's Delicious. Very dark roast, but better. I wouldn't know. <laughs> My favorite thing ever was in that ice cream episode where you got to try matcha green tea. <laughs> and we felt so bad, and you were like, eh, but it's good. <laughs> accidents happen, and sometimes, like the great Bob Ross said, they're happy little accidents. <laughs> Is that good? Oh, yeah, because I, I want some. Enough? Don't be taking all the gravy. Jeez, there. Sorry. Bud. I gotta say. Okay. This is looking pretty amazing. Don't forget. I can't forget. Sprinkle some cheese on there. Some cheddar. Some cheddar. It's always better with cheddar. Is that enough cheddar? Now it is. <laughs> always better with cheddar. Here is the finished product. Look at that. All right. Now, see, just imagine it with turkey, and you've got Thanksgiving. Okay, now. <laughs> Is there a specific way to eat it? Yes. Okay. Now we have this beautiful, beautiful display of deliciousness. Okay. Now mix it all up. Are you for real? Mix it all together. Well, then why did I have to move my chicken around? Just because you gotta start in a good place, you oh, know? All right, all right. Now. Why do you even make the pocket of gravy? This makes no sense. Because it's easier for mixing, all right? Don't question it. I don't think it is. It is, it's all, look at that. It's all spread out evenly. Okay. Okay. Show them what they're done. <laughs> I mean, I liked it before. Okay. As my grandpa said, that's something only the inside of your stomach should see. <laughs> Cheers. Wait, I didn't. I need a piece of get chicken. Get it? You gotta get a piece of chicken in there. All right. Cheers. Down the hatch. Mm. I kind of wished I'd have ate it without mixing it. No. I that's yeah. not the way to do it. It has to be. I like being able to taste each thing individually. Now it's just a big taste. Maybe your taste buds aren't as refined as you think they are. They are. Mine can tell every little bit of difference. No, <laughs> you're wrong. Mmm. And this is the CBD bowl. No, CDB. That's my initials. Huh? I need salt. We didn't. For we forgot salt. Yeah, so that's yeah. Fine. We do need some salt. That's fine. That's normal. Everyone should always put salt on there. There you have it, folks. Mashed potatoes, corn, gravy. Chicken or turkey, and some cheese. Because everything's better with cheddar. So now we've passed that stop. It's getting late. We want a quick little snack. A little snack? So this was the main course. That was the main course. Okay. Now we're having a snack, and then on to dessert. Okay. So this is like the nine o'clock snack? Yeah, just about. Okay. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And then we'll have our midnight dessert. Exactly. Nice. That's right, and this next one is just, it's just a nice, quick and easy thing. It's a, uh, you're looking in the fridge, you don't want to take much time to make anything, so you throw this together, and it is quite delightful in my book. Well, I'm excited to try it. You better be. I just love that we're not eating anything terrible today. <laughs> <laughs> so true. Now this here, 
is a spicy little treat. Spicy? That's right, I call it the spicy raw dog. Boom! Raw dog in it. You ready for this? Simple, but quite delectable. Come on. Ooh. Oh no, what's, what's happening here? <laughs> What's going on? A little premature, don't you think? <laughs> All right, grab your cheese. I'm crying. Stay with me now. One Stay second. with me now. One second. Okay. Get oh. yourself a piece of cheese. <laughs> Slap it right in the palm of your hand. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Get your spice. All right. Give it a nice little little swirl. Now this is a dessert. No, this is a snack. Oh, snack. Okay. What did you do to my sauce? It was coming out all by itself. Okay. Oh, interesting. I went from corner to Grab corner. Grab your raw you dog. Went down the middle. Yep, right down the middle. Grab your raw dog. Okay. Slap that bad boy right in the middle. Okay. Give him a nice little roll up on one side. See, overlap I, the other I messed side. up. I messed up. I should have went down the it's center. Seeing you can res you can save yourself. There you go. Spicy raw dog. My self pick. You got your meat, your cheese, and your spice. Exactly. Now most of the time, I do this with, I think this is a turkey hot dog. Yeah, turkey hot dog. It's quick, it's easy, it's got some protein in there somehow. Mmm, not his cup of tea. Not my cup of tea. <laughs> <clears throat> I can tell by the uh, unfinished yeah. food that I presented to you. <coughs> it's got a spice to it. Ah, uh, yeah. There it is, folks, the spicy raw dog. It'll be done in 45 seconds or less. What do you think? I'll give my ratings after. Ah, oh, okay, okay. After we try all five, I'll rate each one individual. Well, now I'm taking you to a very special place. <clears throat> We're just arriving at Tasty Town. Okay. And and this is the namesake of Tasty Town. The tastiest of all tasty things that we've had tonight. Okay. The cherry on top, as it were. Does it have a cherry on top? No, it does not, because that's, no. I don't like it. Okay. I don't like the texture. <laughs> okay. No cherries. <laughs> Got you. Unless they're highly processed. Okay. Full of sugar. <laughs> So no cherries, but it's the cherry on top. Got it. Oh yeah, you know, it's it's 11.59. You're thinking to yourself, I should go to bed. But wait, there's more. There's more. You got time for one last treat, and this is it. All right. Brr, are okay. you ready for the, the little lad? Do you the know little why? lad? Do you know why it's called the little lad? Not a clue, but I'm gonna find out. Cause it's berries and cream, baby. Oh. That's right. Vanilla covered, well, actually, now tell Pop them. Tart covered vanilla. You need to explain to them the little lad. The little lad? <laughs> yeah, with berries and cream. Berries? Yeah. Oh, and what else? And cream. Berries and cream, berries <laughs> and cream. I'm a little lad who loves berries and cream. Now, little lad, I don't know <laughs> if you guys haven't seen it. Berries and cream, the Starburst used to have a commercial. No, no. Yes. We're going to send them back to our own video. Oh, did we do that? Yes, in the hair video. Oh, yes. Take a look. See Even here. Even better. Berries and cream, berries and cream. That's we'll right. link to it. Go check it out after this episode. You won't be disappointed. Now here's what we're gonna do here. Okay. Now you can do this one of two ways. Here with what we got, we're gonna go ahead and just plop. Okay. Stay there. Now typically, you throw this in a bowl. Okay. And you just bowl full ice cream, you throw the Pop-Tart on top. But now we're making our own ice cream sandwich. Now we're making our own ice cream Sammy. Okay. So is this still the little boy? This is the little lad. Little lad. My little lad? Here you go. Oh, little boy, huh? This one started backwards. <laughs> yeah, maybe let's stick with the little lad. Okay, it's gonna be messy, but get in there! It is. Yeah, I gotta show him what's up. Look at that. All right, initial thoughts. This is probably gonna be delicious, not gonna lie. I mean, you can't go wrong. It's got ice cream in Stick it, it in your mouth! Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm losing it! <laughs> Okay, this is why I normally eat it in a bowl. <laughs> it is falling apart. I forgot to inform the chef. <laughs> I gotta say, eating this like a sandwich is amazing mm -hmm. because the Pop Tarts are hot. Mm -hmm. You bite into the Pop Tart and your teeth are coated in warmth. Mm -hmm. And it gives you the ability to bite into the ice cream. Exactly. With none of the repercussions. Mm -hmm. Very astute observation. 
Isn't that fantastic? That is pretty good. Oh, mm-hmm. Ah, tasty. All right, well, we're here. We've arrived. We have arrived. We are in. We have partaken. We are in heaven. I'm in heaven. What are we in, Flavor City? No, Tasty Town. Tasty Town. <laughs> Flavor City's in the rear view mirror. <laughs> Tasty Town, we're here. <laughs> I gotta say that last one was rather tasty. Now, I gotta say, I'm very disappointed that none of these had specific ingredients. You didn't have a specific brand for your ice cream. You didn't have a specific brand for your now, hot dogs. Now, there was some, there was specific popcorn. There was specific That's popcorn. That's the most important. Okay. The hot dogs, I usually get the Ginny O Turkey Franks. That is okay. specific. Okay. Um, but I've been known to, you know, if I had other hot dogs, to go with a, you know, a, a ballpark Frank here and there. Okay. But, see, the thing with specificity is, you're setting yourself up for disappointment. Okay. What happens when you're craving this little item, and you go to the store, they don't have any of it. But lo and behold, right next door to where your little friend used to live, is another brand, same stuff, still quite tasty. Okay. So, some of these are variable on the brands, but it's a specific type. Okay. Hence, mashed potatoes. That wouldn't work with mashed cauliflower. Get that crap out of here. Wouldn't work with sweet potatoes? No. Nobody wants sweet. We want salty, savory potatoes. White potatoes. Sometimes the gold potatoes are pretty good, but specifically the brown and white potatoes. Deal. Okay. Okay. You see, strawberry pop tart. Has to be strawberry pop tart. You could buy generic. They're still not bad, but I would prefer the pop tart. Okay. Vanilla ice cream. No specifics. Now you're probably curious on my voting. No, oh boy. So, so are you comparing them to each other and ranking them, or I want to give them an overall score. Okay, let's see. Let's see this. So for item number one, yes. give me the names again. Uh, that's Cheesy Pop. So for the Cheesy Pop, because it's better than I remember. <sighs> mm -hmm. And when I first had it, it was a shocker. I would give it, I'd give it an eight. Oh, solid eight. We're talking out of 10. Eight right? out of 10. Okay, okay. Okay. Good, good, good. Round number two. Round number two, PBCs. PBCs. I'm going to give them a three. Mm, I see, I knew you'd be, be all judgy on the PVCs. It's because, like I said, the cheddar doesn't it's really need to okay, be there. Okay, I get it. It does. Can't have a PVCs without cheddar, then it's just PVC. No plural. Change your name. Change nope, product. Nope, nope. Product is We're great. Going better. Not for everyone. All right. For round number three. CDB Bowl. CDB Bowl. That's right. I'm going to give it a six. Oh, sad. A six. Now, un unmixed. Unmixed. It's undetermined. But I would assume it's better. Like eight I'm seeing, better? Or... I'm seeing maybe a seven oh. on the horizon. I don't know. It's okay. undetermined. Okay. It will have to be okay. determined at a later date. Again, it might help if you use the proper gravy to match the meat. Well, that's what I was asking. I'm just saying. But again, <laughs> you use what you have on hand, okay, people? These are all born out of convenience and speed. Okay. For round number four, we That's got right. Spicy Raw Dog. The Spicy Raw Dog. Spicy Raw Dog. Dude, I'm giving that a one. 10 out of 10 on the name though. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> round number five. The Little Lad. The Little Lad. I got to give that one the best score of the night. An 11 out of 10. Oh my you, goodness! It surpassed my expectations. Ha -ha! It sounded a little janky at the beginning, but there's something magical that happens when you Riz. put two warm Pop Tarts mm. around some vanilla ice cream. Now, I will Very say, tasty. one of the best combinations in that field was the strawberry Pop Tarts with some Tillamook vanilla. Okay. Kind now we're getting definitely. specific. There's, See, there's a specific that's for what you. I wanted. That one's real good. Well, there you have it. There's my rating. Oh, boy. Try these if you have the products at your house. Do it. You should. Let us know if you agree with my ranking. Rankings or if you agree with Cam's ranking. Now, actually, I need to know what your rankings are of your Tens products. across the board. Ten. Maybe a nine. <laughs> what? Spicy raw dog. You gets cannot a nine. tell me that the little lad is on the same scale as this <laughs> sad thing. Hey, he wouldn't be sad if you would finish him. Goodness. Oh my lord. Leave a I spicy can't. raw dog out in the wind like I that. I can't. I can't. Now, now I do agree. Okay, I'll give that. I'll give my little lad the eleven out of ten for sure. Dang. It is a tasty treat. Now, since today, if you're watching this on the day that we posted it, 
It's a Tuesday. It's a treat yourself Tuesday. Tuesday. So come hang out with us on our Discord. We're going to link it down in the description. If you don't know what Discord is, it's this really awesome modern chat room. That's Think right. of it like that. We're going to hang out, chat, get to know you, and come hang out with us. Give us input on the videos you want to see next. And That's uh, right. Take it to Tasty Town on Tuesday and treat yourself. Ah! All the teas! TT! Woohoo! On that note, goodbye. <laughs> Today, a few episodes. Did my voice just crack? It did. He's scared. <clears throat> <clears throat> and then I get even more excited. Like the next day, when I see it in the toilet, I get excited remembering that I ate it. Are you know you? what I mean? No. It's like, oh, that was good. <laughs> you know? What? I know I'm not the only one. Come on.